What's going on YouTube? So here it is, the three month review of the peptide Tamorlin. So previous video, you saw me introduce it. We're gonna go through it. We're gonna go through all the benefits that it is claimed to have. Like I said though, this has three to six months to see if it has benefits. So three months would probably be the earliest. Let's go over to see all the benefits and I'll let you know if it helped me so far. So here's the first two increased lean body mass and fat reduction so increased lean body mass i can say i'm probably around the same pace i was and i haven't seen a huge jump my arms have gotten a little bit bigger which would be good however i have gained weight so let's go to fat reduction it's supposed to decrease the appetite a little bit so it's more manageable However, my appetite has been a lot more. So I don't know if it's getting into my ghrelin receptors, even though this s'more is not supposed to, but I'm just, I'm very hungry. So fat reduction, I've actually gained a lot of weight. Granted, I know it's fall and comfort food, all that. And I'm not really counting my macros right now, but I don't think the fat reduction or increased lean body mass has come into play and if it does it just hasn't happened yet like i said i've had some increased you know size in the arms but again that could just be from the weight gain it's probably been a weight gain of about 10 pounds 5 10 pounds give or take so so far haven't seen those effects quite yet next one increased energy haven't seen that effect yet either i'm not tired but it's just, I feel the same that I do. I feel pretty good. You know, getting up at, you know, around 345, four is still a struggle. I was hoping that would help a little bit because I'll bring in the other one, increased sleep quality. My sleeping is the same. So that hasn't changed either. I was just hoping that maybe, okay, increased energy and better sleep quality. I could get up, boom, 345, four, spring out of bed. I don't know, maybe that's just being irrational, but I haven't seen that effect quite yet as well. So hopefully again, maybe in the four, five, six month mark, I'll see a little bit of a difference. But so far, nothing too soon. Next one, increased strength, possibly. I was, again, when about the three month mark hit, I've been pretty consistent at the same weight. And strength wise, I did go up. I had a lot of neck injury. So actually I'll tie in the other one, accelerated wound healing. So it was just chronic pain. I had real bad neck pain for, again, during this three month mark from the second month to the third month and still not fully healed. So neck pain has been a big one. So it's still causing me pain. I, don't, I think it's the myotonia, not quite sure, but the wound healing, not exactly coming into play. However, though, when I would take my couple days or a week or two off, my strength, I was actually able to stay either where I was or in a couple days get higher than where I was. So I think the strength might have actually helped me a little, keep me a little bit stronger, which is good because if I have to take those days off and I don't really dip too much in strength, it's good. I know one time I think I had to take two weeks off, I did see a dip in strength, but in a week, I was back up where I was. So that's actually really quick. Obviously muscle memory. And I know some people are like, well, two weeks isn't much. <laughs> but with MD, yeah, that's a lot. So you lose that muscle pretty quick, your strength. And I was happy to get back up in about seven days. And then soon after that, I was benching or lifting higher weight, which is really good. So possibly, I'm not sure. Like I said, obviously when you gain weight though, you get a little bit stronger. But once again, I still think though, coming back after injury, I was able to maintain where I was. So I'm gonna say possibly, I'm not definite, but definitely one of the more positive signs. Two more, improved bone density and improved skin quality and collagen. I can honestly say I haven't seen a difference yet. My skin is definitely the same. There's been no big change in that. And collagen, haven't seen it come into play quite yet. 
I'm waiting for those. I'm hoping. I know collagen is a big one. Skin quality, like anti-aging, is a big thing with peptides. I mean, like I said, three months. I don't. I have a lot of faith that this will actually work. But three months, especially, it's still like the three to six month mark. I feel like with MD, I'm not a normal body. Okay, we're a little bit difficult. We're different. You know, like whether it's muscle-wise or body-wise, I think it's gonna take a little bit longer. So the tail end at six months is gonna be more impactful, but I wanna know, let you know where I am right now. We're gonna go over one more thing and then we'll wrap it up. All right, so the big reason why peptides spoke to me and the real reason for trying them is because I wanna reduce the pain. All right, shortly after my vaccine, I don't know if this is related, but a lot of pain occurred. I had a couple of pec injuries and pec strains and just neck pain. I needed that to get resolved. So that's why I'm trying this. Like I said, I'm not sure if the pain really has gone down. I, you know, I had some bad neck pain, it resolved it, but I'm also doing, you know, chiropractor massages, trying to get that all squared away and fixed. The pain hasn't really, I haven't seen much of a difference. However, though, one big thing with muscular dystrophy is Sex can be kind of an issue where it's either difficulty performing because of pain or afterwards it's pain. Now, it doesn't affect Julie and I where, you know, of having it and doing that. But afterwards, I was always in pain. I would have to take a little quick break and, you know, just rest and recover. However, now it's not as difficult. I can actually just get up and continue on with the day. So I think that's been a little bit better pain wise. I think that's pretty much related. But like I said, those are all of the positive benefits that it is to offer. Like I said, I have, I'm not sure if I've seen the best results after three months. However, though, the six month review, I don't want to keep you waiting. So I'm going to try to post all of these, like I said in the last video, pretty consecutively. So you're aware of what's going on. But as of three months, I've been on it. We're gonna see what happens at the six month and I'll decide whether it has worked and whether or not I'm gonna keep going on it or I will switch to a different result. But I'm gonna find the one that works best for us. And I promise you I'll impact you with all of the results. If you still with me this long, I appreciate it. All right, please don't forget to like and subscribe, Maribel Fitness, and I'll see you all in the next video.